that's Lauren with Just Vegan In, where in each episode we try to look at a different aspect of the vegan lifestyle. And ooh, tonight you're coming out to dinner with me. Oh yeah, we are in North London and we are at East West Pizza. Yes. Now, this place is not totally vegan, but I have been eyeing it for a while because I love the concept. I don't know any other place in London doing it. So it is like Indian and Italian fusion. Oh my goodness, the flavors will be booming. And we are gonna try their vegan options. Mm -mm 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 -mm. And hey, if you're new to the channel, please make sure you subscribe because believe me, you do not want to be missing out on these deliciously good times. I'm going to share with you what we will be eating. Now I have magically teleported myself back to my place to chat with you about all this. But no, the restaurant was really crowded, which was great. And I just wanted to be able to, you know, chat with you clearly so you, you, you could hear me. But we did go on a Friday. So this is definitely a little word of advice. Definitely book in advance because when we were there, there was even a little bit of a line that went outside the door which, hey, are all good signs. Anyway, enough chatting. Let's share what we will be eating. Okay, so for the starters, we got the onion bhaji, Desi's patatas bravas, chana masala with rosemary focaccia, the crispy corn chili chat, Oh my gosh, and of course we had to get a pizza. Mm -mm -mm. We had to get that lovely combo of, of Italian-Indian pizza. So we went with the jackfruit masala. Mm -mm -mm. Oh yes, and we got a little side of vegan garlic, alioli. Let's get to eating. Time to have a little chat. And that is pun intended because believe me, in a bit we will be chatting about the crispy corn chili chat. Oh my gosh, I loved it. But anyway, I wanna to talk to you about the chat that I had with Desi, the owner, and just kind of hearing a little bit of his story, how he came up with the concept because East West Pizza is the only Indian Italian fusion restaurant that I know of in London. And let me tell you, it is incredible. If you are a foodie, you are going to want to try this out. He's really got the flavors down so well. But what was interesting is he was saying the the it's been around for four years and the first three years business was a little bit slow. Maybe people were a little tentative to try something new, to try some amazing flavor combinations. But believe me, they made a mistake because it is it is incredible, it's something new, it's innovative, it's creative, and honestly, like I said, if you are a foodie, you are going to want to try this. But luckily, this past year, it has really been picking up, and like I said, hey, I mentioned before, when I was there, there definitely was a bit of a line outside the door, so believe me, people are taking the hint and finding out that this is the spot to go. He came up with this concept because it was two of his favorite foods, so he thought, why not combine them? Oh my gosh. Well done, Desi, and thank you very much. And then he ended up bringing on board a chef who has worked at two Michelin star restaurants. So they really have concocted and created some wonderful flavor combinations and food cuisine that honestly will tantalize those taste buds. Really, this is quite high on my list because if you want to try something new and different, this honestly is your spot. And believe me, these flavors combine so well. Okay, enough about that. Let's talk about the food. Oh, wow. Mm. Woo! Very, very impressive. Let's start with that. Okay, enough about we got to get to the chat. This, this 
crispy corn chili chat. It was incredible. It was literally crack. My partner and I, we went and ate here together and we were almost fighting over it. Like every bite, it was like, you know, nudge, nudging the other one over just to get some more. It was incredible. It, it reminds you of a samosa chat without the samosa, but with like corn. It is nice. It's crispy. It's just, it's booming with flavors. So nice and colorful that, I mean, it is a starter. You must get that is for sure. And I was chatting with my partner and she was like, you know what? She's not always always a huge fan of bhajis, but I don't know what they do here. They, I, I did ask Desi and of course he wouldn't, you know, let me know their secret ingredients. They actually were incredible biting into each of them and the sauce with it. It was, it really, it, I mean, highly recommend it. And I would say must get that. Oh my gosh. And I was really excited to try this because it was a nice combo of like the Indian and Italian. And that was the rosemary focaccia with the chana masala. It had a nice amount of spice that like lingered in such a positive way. It wasn't overpowering, but it really did hit the spot so, so, so nicely. And the Desi's patatas bravas. Once again, it's just adding that Indian seasoning to Patatas Bravas, which, you know, really highlights and brings out the food. I was talking to Desi and he really is bringing Punjabi flavors to the cuisine and you are definitely tasting it. So it's really making a lot of these dishes something new. Oh my gosh. And that pizza. Yes. So Desi does, makes all the dough for the pizzas and you could tell it's made with a lot of love. Wow. 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 What I did like about it and I didn't really end up doing this, but you could technically, if you want kind of roll that dough up and almost create like a, almost a wrap with that pizza. It's just cause how that dough folded. It was nice. It was soft. It was, it was, I'm going to say it was sexy. I don't know. Like that's what's coming to mind. It was just made everybody perfect. And with that jackfruit masala, oh my gosh, once again, why has no one else really done this? Combine like the Indian with the Italian food. It really works so, so well. I 100% will be coming back. My partner who comes and does a lot of these vlogs with me was seriously impressed and she can be quite a hard food critic, but she, I mean, we were already taking, writing down a list of friends of who we would like to bring here. So if you want to experience something fun, new, innovative, creative, this is 100% your spot. I really can't recommend it enough. It's definitely a top place to visit in London. I did mention before, I was trying like their vegan options because they're not just a totally vegan restaurant, but I just thought, hey, these flavor combinations are I I incredible. I basically, I've been stalking it. I was like, I need to get myself in there. I've been stalking them on Instagram and I was in for a treat, a true delight. You will too. I highly, highly, highly recommend this place. And everyone, as always, thank you so much for watching and please make sure you like, share, and subscribe to Just Vegan In and follow me on Instagram at just vegan in, yeah.